What's up guys, Bronxy back here with another video and this time it's going to be a Thought Boy haircut tutorial. I know people are wondering, oh Ray, how did you get your hair like this? You know, is it dreads, is it twist? You know, what is it? And you know what I told him? I don't know! So, I'm really finna tell y'all how I got my hair like this because I know a lot of people have questions. In the beginning, I used to keep it a secret, and like I used to say, like I just use water or something like that. But now I really like tell people like what I use and that stuff. So this is what I use. I use a wave brush, and I know people have a lot of negative things to say about like using a wave brush, cause a lot of people are saying like it can like make your hair fall out. But that's mainly if your hair isn't healthy. So if you use a wave brush, make sure your hair is healthy. And do like when you put it in a circular motion, do not abuse it. Like, don't just keep doing that, just do it to where you get your desired look. But if you really want to make it all tight and jetted up, by all means, do you. Now, what else do I use? I use the Eco Styling Hair Gel. So, you see that? See if I can get it to focus. Yeah, y'all. Just go to like your nearest hair products, hair product store, Walmart, Target. I don't know, fucking Wise. Literally every like grocery store, hair store, Giant has this. You know, you can always find this anywhere, and it's cheap too. And you're gonna need to pick the main thing to pick out your hair. That's the first thing you wanna do. Pick out your hair. Don't just do it when your hair's nappy because that's just gonna look weird. So. Make sure you get a pick first before you guys do that. Then curling style mug. That's one of the most important things because when you first start out, your hair is going to be like, it's going to have more of a curly look to it. So you're going to want to use this, especially for like thick curly hair. So make sure you use that. Now, how I use the eco styling gel and the curling style mug, I mix these two both together. Right? Cleaning my hands. Up and down. Put my hands in a circular motion like that to really get it in there. Don't try to like dig into your scalp with it. Just get it on the top and back and forth. Or don't dig into it. Not like that. Up and down. Circular motion. You good. Um, sometimes I might use warm water or cold water depending on the weather. Say like it's during the summer I use cold water. But I only did this in the beginning of the my stage. Now I just put some eco styling gel like every morning. I just like brush it through my hair, just to make my hair look, look even better. So that's really what I do as far as right now. But in the beginning, use these two, please. It'll help you a lot. And if your hair messes up in the morning, for like instance, say like you wake up and you have bed head, just use the wave. Just use this wave brush. Circular motion, get to how you had it yesterday, and you cool. That's basically what I did. So I mixed this, mixed this, put in my hair, wave brush. Got it to the look I wanted. I was cool, I was smooth, I was straight. Now, in the beginning of the stage, you wash your hair. Try not to wash your hair often, but only wash your hair if, like, Say like you're an athletic person and you play, you had like a basketball game or something. Yes, wash your hair. But if you're just sitting around not doing shit, try not, I would say like, wash your hair every three weeks. That way, you know, it has time to like lock up, jet up, twist up, whatever, whatever you look you want, just give it time. Try not to wash too often, often cause that can actually loosen it up for those who didn't know that. So that's what I recommend as far as like the beginning stages. Use that, follow what I'm saying. I'm giving you guys the keys to get your hair like mine. Give me all the keys. And when I go to sleep, I don't use any do-rags cause that can actually like flatten it. <laughs> so I don't recommend using do-rags unless you want your hair to be like that, but I don't use do-rags. The most I use before like when I go to sleep or something, I just take See that? That's a tie. I took a tie. Put that shit in my hair. 
show you what your boy working with. I cut my hair today, so it looks a little short. So it's not as long. But yeah. Y'all see that? It's not as long because I got a haircut, but yeah, just have it like that. And when you have it like that and you wake up the next day, bro, when you wake up the next day with your hair tied up, then you take it out, oh my. It just makes your hair look even longer when you wake up. I promise you. Put a tie in your hair and go to sleep. Your hair is going to look 10 times longer. It's just going to look crazy. But yeah, those are like, these are the keys I'm helping y'all. Like, these are the keys. Eco Silent Gel. Wave brush. Don't abuse the wave brush. I recommend, uh, don't get a hard brush because that will really, like, pull your hair out. Uh, you can get a soft brush. But it won't really like get in there but it will still work mine is like in between so it's not rough or it's not really soft it's just like right in the middle so try to get a brush like this and you'll be smooth the pick use the pick first guys pick out your hair all that make sure you're good curling style of milk mix this up you straight straight that's literally all the steps there will be more videos and like more tips and stuff because I can't get all, I can't give you guys all the keys yet. I gotta let you learn and all that. But yeah guys, that's this for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And Bronx you here, we out. Peace. Go up my class. How you way up on the ground, but then your mixtape was trash. That boy greener than grass. He a 